Michael decides to visit his friend in the hospital and get his wound checked up. Michael's friend has a hard time believing that a man gave him the bite and decides to call the police waiting outside the hospital. Back at the coven, while in recovery, Victor is reprimanding Craven for his treachery, promising him retribution. Victor is deeply pained by the revelation Celine showed him and soon, he is strong enough to move around, donning his leadership clothes as the ruler of the coven. The police catch up with Michael as he comes from the safe house and abduct him, forcefully placing him under arrest in their car. Celine kills most of the attacking lichens but one survives, this is the doctor working with Lucian on the hybrid project. The vampires are worried that war has broken out again and they are right for vampire elders are soon assassinated by a pack of lichens. Soon the moon is out and Michael starts nose bleeding, a sign of starting his lichen transformation process. It is not easy and his ribs break apart, his heart rises and his skin also changes to black. It turns out the police are lichens and they inject him with a transformation suppressor, preventing full transformation of Michael into a lichen. Celine returns to Victor with the Lycan Doctor who survived the onslaught on the safe house, proving Craven's lies. Under chains, the Doctor is tortured to tell about their plan with Lucian. The Doctor talk about tracing Michael Corvin and how they had managed to unite the bloodlines using his blood. The vampire guards arrive with news of the assassination. Victor realizes it is wartime and starts by executing the Doctor right away. While Craven is having a private talk with Lucian, the vampire armies attack with grenades. It is an all-out war between the supernaturals again. Lucian immediately arms himself with vampire killing UV bullets, ready to join the war. Craven takes out his gun and shoots Lucian in the back with silver nitrate bullets, lethal to lichens. While Lucian struggles to stand in pain, Selene arrives with more vampire reinforcements. One of the elder lichens finds Lucian lying dead, he storms out in anger after the vampires and crushes into one, he transforms into the beast form and though the vampire tries to fight, he is no match for him. There are heavy losses on both sides and the vampire commander dies in the clash. Michael is saved again by Selene, just before a lichen attacks him, Michael is grateful and kisses her, Lucian sees them and is happy for the hybrid union. Just in time, Victor arrives with a third wave of vampires, killing lichens like they are nothing for he is the strongest vampire. In the meantime, Celine and Michael are trying to escape, they find Craven on the way and he shoots Michael many times with the poisonous bullets. Before Craven can finish him off, Lucian attacks with his special sword, he tells Celine to bite Michael to save him by turning him into a hybrid like he wanted. Lucian smiles as Celine bites Michael, Victor arrives and pulls Celine away, throwing her against the stone walls, he wants to kill Michael to prevent formation of hybrids. While Michael is transitioning, he is weaker and Victor almost kills him, however Selene picks the sword and cuts Victor's head, and he falls down dead. Michael, the first hybrid is finally safe. 